1940 Field Marshal Ceremony The 1940 Field Marshal Ceremony refers to a promotion ceremony held at the Choral Opera House in Berlin in which Adolf Hitler promoted 12 generals to rank of Field Marshal on the 19th of July 1940. It was the first occasion in World War II that Hitler appointed Field Marshals due to military achievements. The prestigious rank of Field Marshal had been banned after World War I. As part of German rearmament, the rank was revived. Hitler promoted 12 selected generals to field marshal during the ceremony in Berlin for their role in the Suez victory in Battle of France and to raise morale. The ceremony highlighted the power and prestige of the Wehrmacht. France was considered to have had the strongest army in Europe, yet had been defeated in just six weeks. The ceremony was the first time Hitler appointed field marshals and was celebrated like no other promotion ceremony of the war. During the same ceremony, Göring was promoted to the rank of Reich Marshal. After World War I, the prestigious rank of Field Marshal was banned in the Weimar Republic, alongside other restrictions of the Treaty of Versailles. After Hitler and the Nazi Party came to national power in January 1933, they began an expansion of the military. It was part of Hitler's desire to restore the army's power and prestige. In 1936, he revived the rank of Field Marshal. It was the highest and most prestigious military rank in Germany. The traditional attribute distinguishing a German Field Marshal was an ordinately decorated baton. More tangible benefits included a yearly salary of 36,000 Reichmarks for life and all earnings being exempt from income tax. On the 19th of July 1940, Hitler summoned the generals to a ceremony in Berlin's Choral Opera House. After a speech regarding a peace proposal directed at Britain, Hitler personally rewarded his generals with their decorated batons and thanked them for their contributions to the victory. The 1940 Field Marshal ceremony was the first occasion Hitler appointed Field Marshal due to military achievements and was celebrated like no promotion ceremony in Germany. The remaining five years of the war saw an additional 12 promotions, most of which were without ceremony. Flushed with enthusiasm by the swift defeat of the French army, considered to have been the strongest in Europe and the Low Countries in June 1940, Hitler wanted to mark the occasion with the grand promotion ceremony. He also hoped the promotions would strengthen his influence over the traditional German general staff. The 12 generals chosen for promotion, who all had played an important role in the victory. Colonel General Walter von Brachich, Commander in Chief of the Army. Colonel General Feder von Bock, Commander of Army Group B. General of the Aviators Albert Kesselring, Commander of Air Fleet II. Colonel General Wilhelm Keitel. Chief of Staff of Hitler's Armored Forces High Command. Colonel General Gunther von Kulga, Commander of the Force Army. Colonel General Wilhelm von Leib, Commander of Army Group C. Colonel General Wilhelm Lest, Commander of the 12th Army. Colonel General Erhard Melch, Chief Under Secretary of State in Reich Aviation Ministry. Field Marshal Hermann Göring, Commander in Chief of the Air Force. Colonel General Walter von Reichenau, Commander of the Sixth Army. Colonel General Gerd von Ronstedt, Commander of Army Group A. General of the Aviators Hugo Esperl, Commander of Air Fleet III. Colonel General Erwin von Witzelben, Commander of the First Army. In particular, all army group commanders were promoted field marshal. The commanders in chief of Navy and Air Force, Eric Rader and Hermann Göring, were not promoted field marshals because they already held the rank. Göring, however, to satisfy his thirst for prestige, was promoted to the specially created rank of Reich Marshal. This made Göring the senior officer of the military, 
making him an actual superior of army and navy. It also underscored his status as Hitler's designated successor. He was the only person awarded this rank during the Nazi era, and it was abolished after the fall of the Nazi regime. Many thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe my channel and like and share this video.